welcome to your weekly Angel Tarot reading. This week the fairies are giving you the message to get outside in nature more, connecting with Mother Nature and learning from her. I would really love to be filming this outside this week, but unfortunately it's been raining all day and it doesn't look like it's going to end anytime soon. But I have been outside a lot in my garden now that the weather's getting sunnier. And it's really nice to connect with the plants, the birds, the animals, and of course the fairies and the other elementals. It's really nice and healing. And the fairies are urging you to get outside as much as possible. Make sure you are making time, even if all you can manage is to go outside on your lunch break or a short walk in the evening. The most important thing is to get outside. This week I am using the fairy tarot cards. And the cards that I'm going to choose for you are for the beginning, middle, and end of the week. So the card I trace for the beginning of the week is the Ten of Winter. The fairies are telling you that it's time to move on and walk away from anything that is no longer serving you or holding you back. This change may feel stressful, but no one trusts that the angels and fairies will be with you helping you through it. And once it's over, it will feel like a weight has been lifted off your shoulders. So keep moving forward and don't look back. The card I chose for the middle of the week is the Five of Autumn. Like the little fairy boy on this card, it's important to know when to ask for help. And the angels and fairies are letting you know that it's okay to need help and you shouldn't be afraid or ashamed of asking for it. You can ask the fairies and angels for their help at any time and they will either provide you with personal assistance or they will send you signs and guidance showing you how best to proceed and they will point you in the right direction. It's important to remember that there is help if you need it and you accept it, and you are not alone. The card I trace for the end of the week is the Seven of Winter. The fairies are telling you to be cautious of people's true intentions, especially if you tend to see the good in everybody, because sometimes people act dishonestly, and this may lead you down the wrong path and may cause you to miss a good opportunity. But you do not need to worry because the angels and fairies are with you, helping you and guiding you so that you can see past this person's smokescreen and you can see their true intentions. So listen to the signs and guidance that the fairies are giving you, your own intuition and your gut feeling. All the messages this week mean, be brave and make any necessary changes to improve your life. Ask for help when and if you need it. And make sure you know people's true intentions before agreeing to anything. A good crystal to work with this week is fluorite. This magical stone will help to strengthen your connection with the fairies and help you to see the beauty of the world all around you. This week's affirmation is, I am brave, strong and fearless, sending you love, light and fairy blessings. 